Hi guys. Okay, hi guys, right. So, we got a package from Goggles for you. The glasses. Um, yes, glasses. Actually, in that case, I should be wearing my Goggles for you glasses for this. Glasses. Now, um, I didn't purchase from Goggles for you because I liked or disliked the I company. Want two glasses yes. For eight. Now, so I didn't purchase them because I liked or disliked the company. Um, yeah. I had purchased mine and then I purchased these without knowing anything. Um, I just did this because I got a 55% off and uh, we got, I like all the coatings, so the 55% off made a big deal for me. Um, so yeah, uh, if you haven't seen my goggles for you review, I'll post that down below. Now he also got anti-glare, anti-scratch, and um, transition sunglass coating. Now I do have my opinions. I'm a very um, critical person. So I do have some things to say about these glasses that I got from Goggles for You. So I will go ahead and make an update on that. Uh, so stay tuned glasses. for the updated video. Yes, this is your glasses. Now my child has esotrophia which is alternating lazy eyes. So one eye focuses and then the other eye is lazy. And then when that eye gets tired, the other eye focuses and the other eye is lazy. Um, so he can see out of both eyes. And the doctor did say it's good that he has alternating version instead of the, um, excuse me, I'm speaking. He said that it's better that he has the alternating version instead of just one lazy eye because his is so severe that um, if he had more than one, that if it was not more than one and it was just the one eye, then he might have needed surgery. Um, so he does have perfect vision. This is just helping his eyes focus. So um, here's opening the package. I'm not showing you because uh, I don't want to show my address, but inside is the same as how mine was and it's just bubble wrap packaging. Now, hold on. It says goggles for you. This is a child's glasses and I knew his glasses size because he had already worn glasses. Um, he had already worn glasses before and so I already knew his glasses size because I checked on the sides of your glasses right here on the sides. It tells you what the size is and then the other side tells you the model number. Now, um, yeah, so they do have child frame. Unfortunately, Open. my insurance only oh. gives us a free pair of glasses oh. and lenses once, once every two years. Open. So we decided to go this route. Now it does have my name on it because I'm the one who had ordered. So it comes like this. And on Goggles For You website, they give you a virtual try on. So you can go ahead and it doesn't tell you whether or not the glasses will fit your face, but you could see if the styles look good on you. So I picked some in his size and we went ahead and tried them on on the virtual try on and he got to see what he liked. Um, and we took screenshots of them and sent pictures to daddy and my mom and said, what do you think? And he picked out the glasses that he wanted. Now he's four, he will be five um, coming next month. So uh, yeah, we're gonna open this. And now it does come with a microfiber cleaning cloth. Now I also got the antimicrobial, which I got for him as well, the coating on his glasses. So they make it much easier to clean supposedly, which I do have on my glasses from the yeah. optometrist. But this microfiber cleaning cloth is horrible. It's the worst microfiber cleaning cloth. I even have special cleaning spray that I got at the optician. Uh, the, even from Costco and I spray it on there and it just leaves a nasty film, even if it's brand new. Like if I'm going to buy and spend the extra money for antimicrobial and hydrophobic coating on my glasses to keep my glasses cleaner, I want a cloth that's going to actually clean the freaking glasses. Now the ones from Costco are really good. Um, I haven't tried any from the optometrist, but uh, whatever cloth this is, Terrible, 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 terrible. I even washed them correctly with dish soap and they're still terrible, even brand new. So do not recommend this cloth, but it comes in the same uh, goggles for you um, uh, plastic case, which is good for kids because you can drop it and it's not going to break. 
and it has their address here um, and customer service number in case you wanted that. I'll leave that here on the screen. I don't know if that's focused, but there you go. And so I'm going to put this cloth back. Sit up, buddy, we're trying your glasses. So um, he loves his glasses. He's very good with glasses. I don't need to get special um, like yeah. rubberized glasses or child specific glasses because he's very careful and keeps his glasses nice. So I'm very lucky for that. My other child on the other hand, he's going to need something a little bit more or a lot more sturdy. Um, come on, let's try on these glasses. So these are the glasses he picked out. It says on the side, 18148, which is probably the model number. And his glasses size is actually a 45, but we got these because they are a little curved on the edges. Um, this is 46, 16, 130. So 46 is the lens size. 16 is this eyebrow, between the eyebrows portion. And 130 is how far it goes back on the ears. Now he's a smaller size, uh, four, almost five year old. Sit up, let's show the people your glasses. Come on, turn around, show the camera. Now, these are his glasses. This is what they look like, the shape. They are similar to what he had in his old glasses, but you can see it's very, um, yes. So he's farsighted because of his esotrophia. Come here, let's show people your glasses. Can I, I can't Come on, we're gonna show the people your glasses, sit up. All right, now let's put the glasses on, on your face. Now they're going to, don't touch the lenses. He has a trouble with touching the lenses. Now he's going to need them adjusted because don't touch your lenses, please, because we like this back oh, earpiece so cool. to be bended a little bit more so they don't fall off his face because they are a little big otherwise just because his face is so small. So let's put these glasses on. Now he also got the transitions lenses, which we didn't uh, get before. And I paid 30 something dollars for that his glasses, gla including shipping. We got new glasses. Yes, we do. What do you think of your new glasses? How do they look everybody? They're a little big um, just because they need to be adjusted, but they fit his face quite nicely. Um, they are a little big. I went with a 46 instead of a 45. Um, so I do need to get the backs bended a little bit. Show the people your glasses. Um, he's never had a transition sunglass coating. So we're going to see how that works. Show them your glasses. Look in the camera, go closer. There's his glasses. Um, as you can see, they need to be adjusted. Yeah, no glasses. Yes, how do, can you see good? Oh, we, we cannot use them. We have to take the new glasses yes, off. Yes, we cannot see without our glasses. What do you think of your new glasses? Tell the people what you think of them. They're cool. They're cool? What else? I like it. I like it? Don't touch the lenses. That's why I got antimicrobial and hydrophobic because they're easy to clean and he's always touching his lenses trying to push his glasses up. Uh, even if they do fit properly, he always likes to make sure that they're on his face. Well, now he's leaving, but that's the kids' glasses from Goggles for You. I'll show you what the transitions coating looks like on the kids' glasses. Um, so you can go ahead and check that out. But I think that this is a good option for kids, especially because they're Oh, he's telling daddy how excited he is for his glasses. But I, the thing is, you can go to the optometrist and get them adjusted to fit your face properly because everybody's face is a different shape. And he likes his ears bended, the, the temple piece bended way down. But this is a good option for people who don't have the insurance or the money for, for glasses. And even if you do, it's good for kids' glasses because kids' prescriptions their eyes and their bodies are still growing. And if they're doing eye therapy, like my child is, their prescription changes often. So you can get new glasses and it's cheaper than just getting their lenses replaced at the optometrist. You can get all the coatings, uh, anti-scratch, anti-glare, uh, and the anti-scratch is really good, especially for rough kids. And um, this is not sponsored. I paid with my own money. I'm just saying what I think but it's not all uh, flowers and candy and perfect. There are some pros and cons, which I will discuss, but yeah, um, I will post a picture and a clip of the transition coding and what he thinks. 
and the anti-glare, all of that. The reason I liked it is because it has UV protection, which UV protection for a longer period of time is better for your health. But um, yeah, you put UV protection uh, sunscreen on your skin, why not for your eyes? And this is the cheapest way to do it. I think at Costco, they charge you like $120 just for the lenses. And then that doesn't even include the frames, which are like $55. So think of how much I just saved for a kid's glasses who's going to scratch them, get them dirty, change their prescription. You know, I'm not spending all of that time and money doing that. Of course, I still gotta go to the optometrist, but that's covered with my insurance. So uh, yeah, there's not all pros. There are some cons, which if you wanna see that video, uh, stay tuned because I'm going to be posting that with these glasses. And down below, I'll post the video of these glasses originally. Um, and then I'm going to be getting glasses from the optometrist coming in the next few weeks or so. Um, so I'll make a video of the pros and cons and comparing and contrasting glasses from Costco, this goggles for you website, and the optometrist. So you can see all of that and my very salty, very critical opinions. Um, so yeah, I'm glad you got new glasses. Stay tuned for the picture in a minute on the video. And um, yeah, hope you can see the world with some new eyes. I don't know, just trying to be inspiring. But anyways, we're going to go see some things. So thanks for watching. Bye.